Hi guys, so we're back at Burley. This time we thought to, we'd take you from Burley because we've done, obviously we did Miami, um, Bur North Burley. Uh, we've done Burley before, but we'll take you through the National Park at Burley um, and have a look around and take you um, all the way through to Chalabhadra, which is on the other side of the National Park here. Um, you have a look. So basically that's the map there. So we're basically here guys. So um, what we thought we'd do is we'd take you all the way around and come out down the bottom of Talabadra. So let's jump on, let's go for a walk. So we're in a beautiful part of Burley here guys on the National Park. Um, so again, um, as, you, as you, I said in my previous video, this is all made by um, um, millions of years ago by volcanic activity and rocks, but you can see down here, just down there, all the rock fall away. And what a beautiful, this is basically the open ocean coming around back towards the beach over there. So we were at um, North Burley just over there my past video and there's surface paradise in the background so guys beautiful down here this morning as usual we picked a fantastic day to be down here and i'm loving it let's go for a walk again i get a little bit breathless my thoughts are too big can i get some comfort please Should have been honest It breaks in my heart It's weighing me down, baby I'm like a river that's overflowed The sooner you know it, the less do we hurt Let me speak the truth I know So guys, if you look up the top, um, I don't... I, I didn't realise that it was even up there I've lived here most of my life, but there's um, a lookout rock and, and um, where the tribes, the Aboriginal tribes from million years used to go. Just have a look around. Turn the page and burn it. Let's make up a big bonfire On the beach with the stars as our lighter And throw our problems in the flame Hold me like this is the first time 
Our destiny calls, not leaving this incomplete Won't you lay it on me? Turn the page and burn So you can imagine being here millions and millions of years as the average was actually, there was no paths back then obviously <laughs> so they couldn't just um, they couldn't just take a path and walk down, but they used to climb down through the rocks. Um, and down below is the beach, so climb down to the rocks, obviously natural bushland, so they catch their food. Um, mostly seafood um, is what they used to eat there here though. Um, so they climb down through the rocks, down to the water, and then obviously back up again to the top of the hill where um, so a massive climb every day, so taking everything up and down, probably two or three kilometers climb, so yeah. Things have changed, we've got walking paths, makes it a little easier. I get a little bit breathless, my thoughts are too big. Can I get some comfort, please? What a beautiful day we've got again. I just can't, I, I, I cannot do it wrong, guys. I've got to give you a nice day every day I come out here. So um, what a beautiful day. We're going to go down, obviously, through those bushes there before you just saw where the beach is. We're going to go down there shortly. Um, if you have a look, um, according, there's a sign here that says, look for a jabreen. Uh, Nagulua a jabringo. Uh, according to Kambambari legend, a jagulaga was Burley Head was once flat. So sand dunes and everything else. Um, and then the creation spirit, uh, Jabrin, transformed all this into a, um, a rocky outcrop. Um, and then the pathway then led him to the ocean where he took a long swim back to the, out to the horizon and then came back again. He emerged from the water, a giant and enormous, enormous stature. He rose up to full height and raised his arms to the sky. As he did, the level ground following his hands upwards with his fingertips and formed the headlands at Jagurga. Rocky fingers and pointing seawards. Interesting story. So obviously the, um, the Aboriginal Indigenous um, had their own dream time and, and their own uh, reasons why Burley Headland formed and everything else. But um, we were obviously uh, we're walking on their land so we respect um, we respect the indigenous here and pay respects to the those that are living and those that have passed recently thanks guys let's go let's keep walking one thing one thing I find here guys and um, it was just a, it's just a funny story. One thing I do find here in Australia is um, they're not a vlogger friendly community. I just, um, I'm doing my camera and I had two people walk past and say, oh, red flag, like, um, like I'm some sort of um, pervert or, in, or um, you know, rogue cameraman. Um, guys, I'm just vlogging. Uh, isn't it funny? I, I go overseas and I don't have a problem, but um, here in Australia, they're like, oh, ah, red flag, don't do it. <laughs> Come on, Australia, get with it. It's, it's vlogging. It is such a beautiful day. We've got so many people out here on the walkway today, so I have to keep turning my camera around. So red play, red play, no joking. I'm turning my camera around. Um, beautiful, the sun's out, the sky is blue. I'm, God has granted me another great day. Thank, thank you so much. Um, 
and you know what it's 20 degrees guys so quite cool but quite nice we're gonna cut through now and we're gonna come down through to the beach to show you what's going on so we'll get with you in a minute So as, as yesterday uh, in my video, sorry, yesterday, my video, my last video, guys, on, on North Burley, Miami, remember I said the powder, powdery sand, it's like Barocco, right? Um, same here at Telebatchel, guys, have a look at this. It's so soft, the sand is so soft, so white, so powdery, so give me an idea. When it gets wet, obviously it's dark, but um, up here on the dry sand, it's very white and powdery. Um, but uh, I'll show you where we come from. So this is the um, this is the national parkland behind me. So I'll turn it around. So guys, we come from way, 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 way down the other side of that hill here. So, but uh, uh, you've got to come down here. You've got to do the walk. Absolutely beautiful. Let's take over and have a look at this. This is like an, um, a tucked away estuary between, um, to, between a suburb and here in the Gold Coast. Um, therefore, it's quite relaxing. It is um, tidal and there are currents, so you still have to be careful, but this obviously goes out to the open ocean as well. So it's more like, a, um, they call it Talabudra River. So it's more like a river that comes in from the sea. So let's take it for a walk.
What a beautiful day. I don't know the rest of the song, but <laughs> it's a beautiful day. I don't know. I don't know. Forget it. Guys, did I remember to tell you that, um, like, uh, have a look? God is good. Did I say that? I said, yeah, the other video. So, yeah, God is good, man. This is so, so beautiful. I uh, wish I could build a house right over here. Right here. How good would that be? I know it's a national park. <laughs> but yeah, man, if you could have a house here, out to the ocean, beautiful. Oh, national park behind you. Imagine how unreal that would be. But um, the tide's actually starting to roll in now, guys. So um, all this area here, all this area here where we walk through now, that will actually come underwater. So as the tide comes back in, obviously because of the ocean, um, it fills this whole area. So we were lucky enough to get here on low tide to see all this. Um, and if we stay too long, we'll have to swim home. And um, I'm a good swimmer, but I'm getting old. <laughs> no joke, lang. Okay, um, so um, let's go have another look around, guys. Uh, let's look around. Together. Come back, come back. Don't run away, little girl. Come here, little girl. Do you want a lolly? You want a lolly, little girl? No, I don't. Go away, Mr. Wolf. My shoes wet. Well, I'm bugging your shoes, eh? <laughs> Shoes. Never too far. Beauty is never too far to go and find. And I would walk 500 miles and I would walk 500 miles just to do this blog. How cool is this though? Millions, millions and millions of years ago, the Aboriginals used to live here in peace and harmony. No white people. <laughs> um, basically, living from day to day, week to week, fishing, hunting, swimming, having such a carefree life. Um, oh, to go back to those days, that would be fun. in all serious, seriousness guys it's it's good to know in, in this day and age um, you know, to 2021 that we still have places like this we can go to um, we still have places we can take our kids and the grandkids to uh, national parkland um, open beaches beautiful protected areas um, and it's good that like I said in this day and age we can retreat to the basics of nature, get back to where, where our roots came from, and still have this to show our grandchildren. It's important we keep these things for our kids, for our grandchildren, for, for the rest of the people of the world. Um, to lose all this, all this, 
what an abomination it would be to lose lose this so we must protect our wildlife our, we must protect our national parks our our heritage our roots um yeah otherwise what are we going to show our kids we're going to live in a concrete jungle and that's going to be it thanks guys It's a long walk, but I wouldn't be called Paul's Outdoor if I didn't go outdoor. If I stayed inside, it'd be different. Paul's inside? No, no it doesn't make sense. Paul's inside. <laughs> Paul's indoors. <laughs> So there you have it guys, that's a beautiful, beautiful Burley Beach on the Gold Coast here. Um, as I said, we just took you around to, um, to Talabudra Hill, which is just over in the background. Around the Talabudra Hill, Burley Hill, Talabudra, um, Talabudra River, and you've got to have a decent look. So that's the end of the coast on this side. There is obviously other places which we'll, we'll do more in the following weeks, but have a look around guys before we go. Before we go, don't forget, subscribe, like, and share. Don't forget to check out my merch site, pools.poolsoutdoor.com. Buy some merch, guys. Get some shirts on. I'm going to get a whole order this week. Come on, check it out. Okay, guys, thanks for staying with me. Um, God bless. Salam up, Paul, and see you later.